All right, so in this video, we're going to learn how to solve multi-step inequalities. And the way you solve multi-step inequalities is basically the same as um, solving multi-step equations. So if you're not familiar with solving equations, please see my video, Solving Multi-Step Equations, because it's a very similar process with distributive property, combining like terms, and inverse operations, all right? The only added piece when you're solving multi-step inequalities is when um, you're dividing or multiplying um, both sides of the inequality, you're going to flip that inequality symbol. So flip the inequality symbol when dividing or multiplying both sides by a negative number. So as an example, if I just have a 2x or negative 2x is less than 6. To solve that inequality, I'm going to divide both sides by a negative 2, okay? And since I'm dividing both sides by a negative 2, my inequality symbol flips from less than to greater than. So that's the only added piece when you're solving multi-step inequalities. You just have to remember to flip that inequality symbol when you're dividing or multiplying both sides by a negative number. So both sides meaning, if I have this, if I have 2x is less than negative six, right? To solve this, I'm dividing both sides by a positive two. So since I'm dividing by a positive number, I do not flip the symbol because I divided both sides by a positive two. So it doesn't matter if your numerator is negative, you have to look at what you're dividing or multiplying both sides by to flip the inequality symbol. So again, that is the only added piece to solving multi-step inequalities, all right? So I have a sample problem right here. So let's go ahead and work this problem out and graph the solution. So we solve it the same way we solve uh, multi-step equations, inverse operations, I bring down my 7x distributive property. So negative 2 times x is negative 2x. Negative 2 times negative 4 is a positive 8. Bring down my negative 2. Combining like terms, 2, 7x minus 2x is 5x plus 8. Now I'm left with just a two-step inequality. Subtract 8. I'm left with negative 10 is greater than. 5x. So I'm dividing both sides by a positive 5. So in this case, I'm not going to flip the inequality symbol. Not an equal. All right. Cancels out. So that is x is less than negative 10 divided by 5 is negative 2. All right. So now let's graph this um, solution to this inequality. Okay. So I've drawn a small number line here to graph my solution. I read that as negative two is greater than X or X is less than negative two. So it's easier to kind of flip it to see how we graph it. X, that smaller side is towards my X. So X is less than negative two, all right? And so I don't have it equal to sign underneath. All right, so up here is going to be an open circle, not shaded because we simply read this as x is less than negative 2. So negative 2 will not be included in my answer. All right, so open circle, x is less than negative 2. So these are all my values less than negative 2 on my number line. So I shade to the left because these are all my values less than negative 2. So I've graphed this inequality, um, solved it first, and then graphed it. Just remember, um, if you have not, if you don't have an equal to sign underneath, it's going to be an open circle. So negative two would not be included in the solutions to this inequality. All right. So I've solved and graphed this uh, multi-step inequality.